Hi guys and welcome to today's video. So I thought I'd go old school with my introduction so you can see I'm back with the community tank right behind me. Hopefully this time I'm a lot less awkward on camera. Today's video is just a chat. It's let's see the animals. Uh, let's do a feeding. Um, I'm going to talk through updates because although I filmed the updates, it didn't really go to plan. So let's get into the video. So the biggest change is obviously my sorority in my community tank. So I ordered a pair and it Three of them, the three new ones are all half moon placards. So Malotic and Vaporeon, who I will insert a picture now because you can't see them with the current setup, were the pair I ordered. And then the seller said, Oh, I'm going to send you a free one. So Garatina, my little dark one, she was the one who were free and breeding for breeding as well uh, very kindly sent me a free breeder and then i opened the box and i saw four packages and it was my girl espion who has one eye so she quite often swims the perimeter with her bad eye what would be facing out of the tank and her seeing eye facing in She's really cute and I thought I might have to put her on her own but she's managing just fine. So then I also got a pair of Wild Better. Um, you will see the female, they have bred but unfortunately the male jumped out of the tank. Um, I had dropped the water by two or three inches um, and he jumped and he's not made it he died um, so I will be getting a new male soon I would like a copper because he was a copper but you get what you can and that's the end of it so that's that's a bit sad and I did a species spot a critter's credential uh, which you know where I got the inspiration from if you watch the others and it was bad and I filmed an unboxing video and it was bad and then I filmed a live food video and it was bad I might do live food now I'll go get a cup. So that's why I've not been active. Uh, and I've not been feeling it. I've been a bit... Uh, as you can tell from the hair I've given up. It's just a mess. Needs a cup, 4th of July. Well, actually, it's only be two weeks after that because I'm waiting two weeks. Uh I just can't wait to get back to normal. You can see my natural colour coming through there. Eyebrows need sorting properly. But I'm back now, so let's go collect let's go collect some live food and then do feed. Okay, so I have depleted the mosquito lava. So we'll just go with what I filmed already. Uh, no problem. So now let's get back to feeding. My shrimp tank looking a bit empty. Oh, there's a cherry. Those guys, oh, and there's a crystal. Those guys are doing really well too. You'll notice I've had a bit of a swap. Tried to breed him and the female just beat him up really badly. 
I'm a test. I'm hoping I might get one more clutch out of him. Oh, there's a crystal as well. I do sometimes. I just bob a few of them in and I'll eat them beautiful beautiful shrimpies love them that's them done uh, let's go downstairs so here I have my community tank and I've got four female bait fish in there four coral cats, some neons, white flamingos and guppies these two can stick together let's Put some over there. There's another girl. So we have Sylveon, who you know. We have Malotic there. Then we have, I don't think I have a name for her. What was her name? Oh, it's gone. I'm having one of them days. And then the girl who saw over there she is called Espeon. What the heck was her name? Oh no, I didn't name her. There's Espeon. Uh, but I kind of like Pangaro or something because she's feisty, she's dark. So I'm thinking a nice dark type. Uh, Pokemon name Garatina. Oh, Garatina. But you can see all these guys are doing really well. Now, I do shoot this in quite viciously because you can see I've got quite a few bottom dwellers. I've got my stone, uh, my chain launches, and my quarry cats. And females are just greedy, they will just eat everything. So if I get it on the floor, it gives them a chance to eat, gives any others a chance to eat cakes, caught and plants, and everybody is fine. So now let's go out and go see my furry animals. I know you've not seen them in a while, and I know most of you probably don't really care about them, because uh, I've kind of turned into a fish channel accidentally, but... I'll always show my bunnies and guinea pigs as well because I just love them so much. Absolutely beautiful out here. The pond has gone bright green, uh, but I've seen newts in there, so I'm not bothered. Herbs. Hopefully going to be a new uh, mosquito lava thing. Nestling's cutting down. Uh, with the babies. Oh, there was a long horn beetle there. Hi, Pat Pat. So they're all chilling and having fun. She's so grumpy. She's so grumpy. Are you grumpy? <laughs> we can see these guys are doing really well. They're happy. They've got lots of grass, lots of shade, lots of water. Keep topping it up for them. They're just absolutely beautiful. So, in a few weeks, these guys are going to be moving into here. And I'm going to have a fish rack in there as well. So this is the room they're going to have. Going to cut a hole in the back. Do a tunnel. Uh, there's a slidey thing there, which is good. And then 
they can just come in and out when they want and have the two to your hutch in there. So I'm sat in a different position now. Uh, I'm going to enjoy the rest of the day. I'm patiently waiting till five o'clock and then I can have a nice chin in the garden and just enjoy the weather. But right now, it is hotter than the depths of hell. I'm uh, 22, 23 degrees per person. 25 I can cope with, but this heat. And it's really close and really humid. Um, I just want to sit in the pond to cool, cool down. <laughs> uh, but that's it for today's video. Um, I've decided no matter what it is like, I'm just going to post it. So if you think this video is rubbish, it's crap, tell me. If you like it, tell me. If you have ideas you would like to see, let me know. Um, whether it's, hey, I've got a fish food for my fish or I've got a rabbit treat. What do you think? Um, I might do one of them. I might shadily order a lot of treats and then give you my opinion, my honest, unbiased opinion. Anyway, so that is it for today's video. Like I said, I'm going to go cool down somewhere, whether that's sitting in swimming trunks in the pond or filling the bath up with ice water. <laughs> I'll see you all next time, guys. Stay safe, and if it's sunny, where you are, enjoy the sun. Bye guys.